Welcome back people, we got some more Fishing Planet for you guys here today. New update has just dropped, so I'm going to show you this um, update, show you what we're going to do, and we're going to get this update done. So, I am here in the new, not in the new, in um, Lenza Villa Fishery. So there is a new Fish Monster mission. I've completed all normal missions and every Fish Monster mission. All of those videos you will find on the channel under a playlist as just Fishing Planet. So if you're stuck on any other mission, check them out. But here today, Fish Monster mission, this update has only just dropped. Since, since it's dropped, I've got this video out as quick as I possibly can. If there's ever an update for a new DLC, um, a new lake, I'll always live stream that face cam and mic. But when I... When we get little small updates like this, I just make videos because some people prefer to watch them eight minute videos compared to watching a long stream for around three hours. Although some people do prefer those long streams. So here, anyway, we got to travel to the lake, which I'm there now. I've already bought a license. Catch and keep pikes one point to one pound. Yeah, you don't want um, to use a big lure for this. And then we get that lure, then we can catch the fish monster itself. So looking in it here in my inventory, I'm going to show you my setup, what I'm using. I'm using a casting spoon, hash three slash zero. I also brought the two with me because I think the three is going to be too big. But we'll try the three first. If not, I'll always change over to the two. So I'm using the river Tex rod. I feel like that that's a very good rod to use um, just because we're not catching very big fish. You don't want a rod to be too strong, otherwise you ain't going to get the distance in casting. I'm also using a Kraken 9000, and I am using, um, that's 46.6 pound max drag, using mono line 50.7 pound, and then obviously, yeah, I showed you that. So, I'm going to spawn in just here. Here we are. And then if we pull out the map, let's have a look at the map. I'm going to head down this way, so we're down there. So let's... Let's go down there. I'm gonna have a few casts with this and see um, see what kind of size fish I bring in with it. If they're too big, then I will use the two. I could even maybe even possibly use a one. So I'm gonna probably stand about here, I guess. Let me have a look on the map here, see where how far I've come down. All right, so that's where I am, just beside this, kind of in the middle almost. Let's um, have a few casts with it. I'm just going to cast it straight down there like that. Oh, Every time I make a video recently, everybody keeps on subscribing. So <laughs> it pops up. I've got it linked. So thank you for subscribing, man. Welcome to the channel. I appreciate it. Also, if you are new yourself, you can subscribe. It's completely free. Or if you want to support the channel a little bit more, you can become a member by clicking the link in the description below. Oh. No, nah, I had a bit of interest there, though. I did have a bit of interest. I'm using the mouse, and I also have the... Um, let me change over to my controller, because I've got the controller on. i got the mouse on as well, so... My controller did vibrate there. So we got to catch five pike. Once we caught five pike, I've then got to go and catch the fish monster. So this video is going to be just to show the pike and then the next video that i do i'll make that as a separate video for the actual fish monster itself but yeah this update dropped today today's day is just so you guys know it's the 27th of may 2021 this update dropped um at 11 11 a.m uk time or probably i'd say about 10 to 11 possibly but yeah about 11 o'clock this update dropped 11 a.m so i'm straight into business i'm straight into working getting it done i'm going to change over to the two right now i think i just don't i think the three is going to be <clears throat> too big and i don't want to catch pike that are too big because they've got to be maximum size of 1.1 pound that's still a pretty decent cast though look at that 170 foot cast with a hash two casting spoon and that that casting spoon is actually quite light so yeah this is definitely a good rod to use good line i'm not sure about the reel i did bring another reel with me as well because just in case this uh this reel doesn't work out too well but i always like to use max drag i think this reel will be fine because i'm not exactly catching very big fish or at least I'm not going to be catching big fish, not not at the minute anyway, not catching these pike. Let's, um, 
might even need to go down to the to the hash one i did get a bit of interest so it keeps on biting so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna move just a little bit in front of these weeds here because i am getting a bit of bit of bites further further out over here so let me move to this spot <clears throat> And let's see if we can get a bit of interest. I probably am going to make a few edits into this video. Just to speed up the process. Because um, sometimes when you do these fish monster missions. Sometimes you've got to move around to different places to catch certain fish. Or do certain things. And sometimes it does take a, a short minute to sometimes to catch the certain sized fish that you need. So i probably am gonna yeah definitely am not probably i am gonna be making a few edits into the video just to speed up the process of me catching these pike and then um that way the video doesn't go on for too long so had a bit of interest there no takers so i am gonna change over to the hash one i think because uh, it kept biting on the three and it's biting on the two but again no takers so tells me that the hook could be too big I'm going to change over and put on a hash one. Let me speed reel. All right, so I'm going to do that when I get my first pike. I'll bring you guys back in just a sec. All right, so I lost the original audio. So I ended up doing a voiceover. And, um, yeah, so, uh, <laughs> oh, well, never mind. Anyway, so, um, I am going to be getting this mission done. I got to... I gotta get pike so to get pike just because I've got other bait rods I decided to use obviously bait rods as well um, to catch the pike that little bit quicker obviously the spinner rod does work and thinking about it now a little bit more you really do not need um, you really don't need a very strong rod at all so you could probably get away with using the very beginning rod level one rod the creek pro you could probably even use the telescopic rod as well just because, um, yeah, these fish are not very big. So because they're not very big, you can get them on very light gear. You don't need anything too heavy. I'm just using what I'm using just because this is what I have to hand. But anyway, never mind. There we go. There's a, a pike. <laughs> so yeah, the, I, as I was fishing for them, I kind of, um, after having quite a few casts, I did keep getting quite a lot of bites, but no takers. So I ended up buying this spoon here from the shop that you can buy from without going back to the main menu. So I got that on the casting spoon, the gold one, um, a hash one. So me even thinking about using a hash three slash zero or a hash two slash zero was way, way too big. I decided to drop the hook size right, right down. And hash one seems to work quite well, actually. So, um... Yeah, you can catch these either on the spinning rod or on bait on the bait rod. I'm going to obviously show you a spinning rod and the bait rod as well. So these are the bait rod setups that I'm using. Again, the gear that I'm using is way too heavy. It does work, but this stuff is really, obviously, this is the best bottom rod on the game. You, don't, <laughs> you definitely don't need that, but I'm just using it because it's what I have. But you could pretty much use any rod, any setup to do this, whether you're using lure or you're using bait. Either way, it will work just as well. So here's me setting up more rods, putting small minnows on. They seem to work quite well. The hash one hook, I should have put that on first. But anyway, yeah, the hash one hook, they're then putting on small minnows. So I'm going to get this done here in this video showing you. And then tomorrow, I'm going to up, be uploading another video tomorrow. So make sure you don't miss out on that, of me actually catching the fish monster itself. For us to catch the fish monster, it's the same as every other fish monster missions. First, you have to do certain things before you can go for the fish monster. And that's what we have to do with this one. We have to get the lure first. Once we got the lure, we can then go for the fish monster itself. So... Yeah, definitely was a lot quicker. I actually got this video done insanely fast. The editing took longer than catching the fish, that's for sure. Um, yeah, using the bait rods definitely is a fast way to, to do it. And here, this is my video clip where I decided to bring my face cam back in. And there's me talking 
but me doing a voiceover because as I said I did lose the, <laughs> I did lose the original audio clip so sorry about that if um if I'm talking it doesn't quite match up to to my face cam yeah apologies for that I, I don't know where I don't know where that clip went it disappeared I, I I don't know if it went into another file or or what yeah I have no clue but when these updates do drop as I mentioned for the DLC for the map I'll always do all the new missions and doing all of um showing you new hot spots how and where to catch certain fish but for videos uh, for updates like this when it's just a, a little small update I'll always make a video on it and of course when them updates do come out I'll, I'll I try and let you guys know there was an update for the boat obviously showing the map but I didn't feel like it was that important for me to make a an up, a video update on on that because uh, when you're driving the boat you can now hit Y and it shows you the map on the little um, fish finder display I didn't really think there was much point in me making uh, a video for that so I didn't bother but anyway there it is pretty fast did not take very long at all so that's it mission is complete great work you've got a pike um, fin spoon and are now ready to hunt for the perch bully so that's what we needed to get we needed to get that lure so that way we're then able to catch the fish monster with that lure you can't just catch the fish monster first you have to get this lure that's why I'm making this video and then we use this lure to get the fish monster I'm quite interested to see what it looks like because I've completed all these fish monster missions and every single fish looks really different it looks really really good so this video is going to be coming tomorrow we're going to equip the uh, lure so to get the actual fish monster we're not going to be able to catch that on a bait rod that we are going to have no choice we do have to use a spinning rod to to catch that fish monster so but as i said i'm gonna work on that i'm quite busy but i'm gonna get that video done so that way it's ready for tomorrow to catch that fish monster and show you guys how and where i caught it um every other mission on the channel you'll find as under as just fishing planet so um yeah check out some of those other ones if you are stuck like the uh, little small short videos that I make do definitely help out a lot to get these missions done. So I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Subscribe if you're new. Turn notifications on. Don't forget to drop a like. Keep an eye out for tomorrow for the fish monster itself. And we will see what this what it looks like. So the update, as I said, did drop today, 27th of May 2021. I've got this video uploaded as quick as I possibly can. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. we catch you again soon with some more fun and games. I am out.